Jesus tonight. <laughs> Fill him. That's not what I said. Fill him up, God. Y'all are mocking me. Get that camera out of here. Okay, okay. Just love how he just. <laughs> I don't. Um. <laughs> am I not invited to this party? <laughs> I got places to be. Up here you do. <laughs> What's that? Excuse me. Yes. <laughs> Alright, I thought you guys were having an interview. Alright. Yeah, Father, hey, we just thank you. We thank you for uh, allowing us just to minister tonight. Minister in song, minister in word. Father, and I just didn't, we just invite your presence just to come tonight. We pray for those that aren't feeling well. Chris and Jeffrey and, and Kim that I know of. And I just pray, God, that your just your hand, your touch would be upon them. But Father, more than, than anything else, we just invite your presence to come tonight. Lord, may lives be impacted. May hearts be changed. Father, we just pray that everyone that comes tonight, Father, will just sense and feel your love and your presence as they're here just worshiping you. Just thank you, Father. Okay, I gotta start off this video blog by saying, hi mom. My mom was worried about me because she hadn't seen me in any of the blogs yet. And so I had to lay the smack down on a few of these guys and say, hey, let me in the blog. So here I am. We just finished an awesome night in Newcastle. We've never been to Newcastle before. It's been a lot of fun and they were radical worshipers and the Spirit of God came. Sean Smith spoke. Man, we love Sean. He is incredible. And he just brought awesome Holy Spirit. Lives were changed. I am convinced that Newcastle will never be the same. It's been awesome. And uh, we get to sleep in just a little bit in the morning and uh, head off to Brisbane. After that, we're in Melbourne. Now, all my uh, American teammates here say Melbourne. That's not correct. The true Australian way, which I happen to know, is Melbourne. We're going to Melbourne, mate. Did I sound like a country Australian person? Like an Australian hick? Skyler, my husband, would know. It's time to go to Melbourne, eh? See? Perfect Australian accent. That's why I married him. Just kidding. 